What's up, you all? Today we're talking about the best ways to stream your Quest 2. Let's go ahead and get right into it. Number one is going to be the traditional PC VR route. This is the OG route, meaning this route, you're going to have to manually link your Quest 2 to your PC. And boy, you had to have a powerful PC because you're running traditional PC VR. Games like Phasmophobia, Half-Life Alex, Boneworks, all of these are not available on a Quest standalone. So not only are you initially going to be playing these PC VR games, you're going to also be encoding and streaming these games so you got to make sure your pc is top notch and respectable you got to be linked and you got to also ensure that you're going down that route to be able to do it in a traditional sense meaning the highest of wi-fi going down hardwire with the ethernet and more so that is the traditional route this is what all the competitors vr competitor is only offering this right now except quest the other vr headset is only available with traditional pc vr streams except for quest so let's talk about the next option my favorite option which is the wireless route so streaming quest 2 wireless has been so fun for me i always do that on my youtube streams all you would have to do is that you're going to have your quest 2 headset you're going to cast to your pc wirelessly going to oculus.com slash casting on your pc then you would enable the share button go to cast on your quest and you would cast it on over to your pc and anything that's now shown on your quest 2 as a standalone is now on your pc and now your pc is just working hardwired to just be able to stream on Twitch. So that one's very easy and that's possibly the easiest route, but this is a native Quest stream wireless notion. You don't get to see Twitch chat and everything while you have your headset on. Now you can manually look up or you can do text to speech, but they're very limited in those options. My favorite route, it takes the least amount of power and all your PC works on is just trying to stream and basically it's just copying whatever you're playing. That one's my favorite route for sure. Then there's route number four, which is a very tough route. This route right here is going to be through your phone. In order to do this route, you're going to have to cast your Quest 2 and, and send it on over to your phone. In order to do that, you would do that through the Oculus app. Then through the Oculus app, you're also going to be able to just minimize that, go into Twitch mobile, and then you're going to start You're gonna start a live stream on Twitch to be able to control it into your casting. All you would do is hit go live on your phone on the Twitch app, and then through the Twitch app, it's going to record anything that is now on your phone. You would minimize that into the Oculus app. As long as you're casting your Quest 2 into your phone, Anything that's now showing in your headset is going to be in your phone, which then is going to work as a middleman to get on over to Twitch mobile. And just like that, that's how you'll be able to start streaming, which is pretty incredible. It won't be perfect, but it's pretty incredible. I know I do have videos on all of these, so make sure you check these videos out. But those are the best ways to do it. Let's go ahead and go over again. Number one, the best way to do it is a traditional PC VR sense. If you want to play the best uh, VR games there is available for PC, Phasmophobia, Half-Life, Alex, Boneworks. Our stream two is a Quest native stream utilizing a link. Means that you don't get to get the best PC VR games, but whatever's in your Quest 2 already, you can just show it off on your PC into your stream. Number three is going to be my favorite, which is the Quest 2 wireless stream. And all you would do with this native stream is that you would cast your Quest 2 wirelessly instead of utilizing a link. Now you don't get the best PC VR games in here, but whatever's on your Quest 2 already, you're able to show off to the world in the streaming. And then option number four is going to be streaming through your phone, which is probably the hardest one if you don't have the greatest internet. But all you would do is utilize the Twitch app and the Oculus app cast directly to your app and after that from the app you go into the twitch app and you're gonna hit go live whatever's on your phone and whatever's showing literally currently on your phone is gonna be shown to the world so that's how you'll do it now note pc vr stream is traditional the top notch but it requires a lot of power a quest native stream is still very limited such as not being able to see chat and more but you're still able to stream if you want to manually look up or if you want to manually do text to speech like those are going to be going to be the best options in order to stream it so those are all the options on how to stream your quest 2 there's four routes and so let me know what you are doing for your quest 2 let me know if that helped you all understand everything in vr streaming i appreciate y'all so much man y'all have a good one peace